Hello everyone, my name is Roman Roxer and today I'm going to talk about how to set up the devices for the VSIC in DSS 8.7. It's very easy. What is the VSIC? You can search by the text. So for example, you will type the red car, hit the search and the system will search for the red car. So how to set up this, uh, this VSIC devices? You can use for the VSIC several kinds of the devices. It can be IVD, IVSS, or NVR XI Pro. The specific model, please refer to our uh, local support team so they will advise you which model you can use it. Uh, you can use the regular browser to log in into your IVD or you can just download the PC client. I recommend to download this PC client. It, refer, it uh, gives you more feature, especially while upgrading your device. So just log in. And over here, the first thing what you need to check if you got the same GUI as me, uh, if yes, more likely you already have the newest firmware. Uh, you can also update the firmware on your IVSS or IVD over here. I'm using the version 3.5 with the building date 2025-0628. So that's the one I'm using. Also, you need to upgrade the algorithms. Uh, that's why I said this PCAPP uh, application is much better because you can upgrade them all at once. You don't have to go one by one. The next thing what you, uh, what you need to do is to go to algorithm. Over here, by default, you got both cards to set up intelligent analysis engine. So you need to set up one of the card on multimodal large model. If you have only one card, set up only for multimodal large modeling and you need to use only AcuPeak or metadata cameras and just hit apply. If you are changing these cards, the device will restart. I already did that, so no need to restart the device. So this is the second thing what you need to do. Then you need to add the cameras. So you add the cameras from your network. So I'll just search for a couple of cameras and I will add them in. So over here for example those and one AcuPeak camera so i'll show you what's the difference and hit ok so shoops edit and the cameras are added to my ivss so this was pretty easy okay next thing what you need to do is to set up the event event i mean what uh, analytics should be done on the cameras as you can see at the beginning, video metadata, there is nothing. So you need to enable the metadata on the camera. If you have metadata camera, you don't have to do that. But this is camera without metadata possibility. So I need enable IVSS to do the metadata. I hit the save. Then I go to second camera and enable, hit the save. Next camera, enable hit the save. You can see all the time operation successful. Okay, this one is AcuPic camera. So you can see over here is AI is done by the camera, not by recorder. So actually I just add three cameras over here, which IVS, uh, IVD will do the analytics and one it will do by itself. Then you can go back to algorithm and you can check it out. So you see one, two, three camera already done, intelligent analysis engine. So this card is doing analytics and the second card, as I said before, is doing those uh, large modeling. So detailed analysis about each result. Now you have also information how many more cameras you can add over here for this feature. Okay, so this is all set up. Now go to DSS. If the IVD is already connected, as in my case, IVD is already connected to, to my PC. Go over here to edit and just click on get info. So the camera with uh, the new edit camera with all the information about the camera will be loaded over here. So you can see I got all my cameras over here. You can double check. Yes, metadata feature are over here and just click OK. Now you can go to Deep Explore and let's say we can search for the car. Let's see what kind of colors already pass in front of my office since this short time. So I'm searching for today. And I got already like three cars over here. 
So if you hit that again in a while, you will have more results. If you want, you can then specify uh, more over here, like, uh, I don't know, red car or whatever. But as you can see so far, I don't have really red car. I can just put uh, car red and white. And I will limit the results over here. So I got only one result over here. So that's how you can use the new WSIG. That's how you set up the IVD device. As I said, if you uh, want to see, this is IVD actually. So if I'm going home, this is IVD. Let's say you are going to log into IVSS. You will see that this is actually exactly the same. So now we are logging to IVSS. And if I go over here on algorithm, you see that I'm using this card for intelligent analysis and the second card for multimodal large modeling. So it's up to you which device you will uh, use it. So as I said, it's supported on IVSS 7.1 series, for example, IVD 5 series, not 3 series, and NVR XI Pro. Okay, thank you very much for watching our short tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.